hey guys welcome back to my channel if you would like to see how i got my natural hair straight and sleek continue to watch hope you enjoy i'm starting on freshly washed hair i use my suave clarifying shampoo and conditioner and i went ahead and deep conditioned my hair and set under the dryer for like 20 minutes with a plastic bag on top of my head now i'm loving my curls I wanted to keep it curly, but I was like, nah, I need to trim my hair and see what it's at and whatnot. So I'm going to take my oil moisturizer, B&B. Um, you can buy that at Walmart, beauty supply stores, like $2.50. That's the only product I use in my hair during this video. I'm just sectioning my hair by finger in four part, parts. And I'm going to take my moisturizer. And then I'm going to moisturize and detangle with my paddle brush, starting from going to the roots. And here's a closer look at what I'm doing. I'm just moisturizing and going back in and detangling the front from the ends to the roots. Very simple. Um, yeah, this is how it looks when it's all detangled. Very moisturized. Loving the curls. My daughter popped in. Say hey. Say hey, Bailey. Hey, Kayla girl. Now I'm just going to blow dry my hair again from the ends going to the roots. Very important. It will help prevent breakage. Now take a second and look at this shrinkage. Oh my goodness. That is so crazy. So crazy. section as I go while I straighten my hair. I'm going to use a edge brush actually missing a few bristles but hey it's still working. We're going to do the chase method. Um, one or two passes that's it. The flare down I'm using is I don't really know to be honest with you. I got it from the mall like you know like one of them little shops at the mall in the middle where they flag you down. I got that like five years ago doing a job actually i was nervous about it because my paul mitchell broke like a month ago but hey it's working so with each row go higher and higher and higher and i'm halfway done at this point and that's how it's looking it's looking kind of silky it's looking kind of greasy also but it's okay okay take a shot baby that was a lot of work Woo! yes lord now i'm almost done once i'm getting to the top once i get to halfway i start going from one side of my head from one temple to the other one pretty much and still working in those four sections now i'm almost done trying to figure out if i want to do a middle part or a side part not really sure bumping gates in the background i'm sure Okay, now I want to state the obvious. I need to trim my ends, but um, I need to use my sister's uh, shears, and I didn't know my ends were that bad, so I just went ahead and threw a little curls in there until I got to my sister's house to borrow her shears. But I'm just doing little curls, trying to make it look cute. It's just on thin, but I'm still cute with it. I'm liking it. curl or whatever I'm wrapping my hair you know it's either I'm going to sleep or it's, I'm doing my hair in the morning I'm not going anywhere until like late afternoon so just wrapping it up and stuff then I took a shower and everything got ready combed it out trying to figure out how I'm gonna do it But you know, I wasn't really 
feeling it. I don't know. I wasn't feeling it. But it was cute on camera. It wasn't cute in the mirror. So now I switched it to the side part. And I felt like my edges had thin, so I didn't lay it down with any edge control because I didn't want like anything sticking down on my edges or anything like that. But yeah, these are the results. Let me know how you like it. If I was all over the place, I'm sorry, baby. That's just how 